after so many doubts and queries i get on my youtube channel on the linkedin from different different people talking about asking about how you got into data domain as a fresher how you got a bigger data engineer so i am a self learned data engineer firstly i'll try to clear out those things and what all skills that you should learn because right now i must like i started my journey 4 years back and into data engineering i started as a fresher in data engineering and right now i have 4 years of experience i am a data brick certified professional data engineer so in this particular video i'll be giving you a road map that definitely in this particular era of 2025 2026 2027 or uh, in next 4 to 5 years definitely if you uh, follow th that particular road map those are the fundamentals major fundamentals that you should know if you want to become ever want to become a data engineer or not that is the very very important there are other, apart from that there are many technologies many things in data engineering that are used so definitely that is a, that that is a next part or a, a later step when you are clear with the fundamentals then only go to go to those things so let's start with the video already i have prepared a proper guide so basically don't jump on the guide directly try to follow the things the things that i am telling try, uh, try to follow the personal experiences that i am telling definitely that will help you otherwise you will be late in your career Uh, like after two years, you will struggle and say that I, I have lost this time and what all things I should learn. Don't do those things. Try to be when you are starting the things or when you have jumped this particular video, open this particular video. Now stay on this particular video and see what I am telling. So firstly, let's start with the things. And I, on the screen, firstly, I'll tell you how to download this particular guide. So firstly, like I'll be giving the link of the GitHub uh, here in the description. Go on the link. Just when you will open on the mobile, it doesn't. Uh, it it will not open like this. It will. It doesn't open like this because what happens when you when you tap on the link sometimes on the mobile it shows that invalid invalid block so don't just ignore that part you don't need to worry about that thing on the three dots on the mobile you will get an option of download just download it like this tap on the download and it will directly download then after download you can just open this particular guide it will be on your mobile that will be easier for you and or you can just uh like like it uh, whatever you can keep it you can fork it basically star it and star will save it in your uh, repository also do a star and give a fork definitely that will be helpful for me so let's start with the things firstly it will take about 5 months uh, to be very very honest if you want to become a data engineer want to become a skilled data engineer want to uh, learn about the fundamentals and also want to know that what a real data engineer does not only working on the excel and all so let's start with the things so firstly you need to dedicate a time of 3 to 4 hours per day then like 5 days a week then only you can expect ki ha in 5 months you can clear off these things or in 180 days or in 1 190 days 200 days you can clear off those things then you need to give 3 to 4 hours only consistently with a very disciplined way and 5 days a week then only you can do that and then and and you can get a good package you can become a good uh, data engineer next thing is major skills major technologies that is like if you want to become a job job ready data engineer the first is python uh, for data engineering uh, and uh, like if you don't know like i have already i already uh, teach many boot camps many live boot camps i teach and i cover all the things related to python uh, like uh, for data domain that is uh, relevant to data engineer that is very very important for data engineer the, those all things if you are not enrolled go and enroll now definitely that will help you it is a live boot camp you can just connect with me and definitely that will help you link is also in the description other than that, you can go to uh, like uh, desi master and you can uh, get all those things link i have already given in the description this is the website desi master slash python you can get uh, the link this bootcamp link so that you can enroll other than that uh, like uh, pyspark pandas are very very important in python also libraries are very important other than that sql is one of the technology that is very major if you want to ever target any data role if you want, want to become a data analyst if you want to become a business analyst if you want, want to become a good data engineer data scientist you need to be good at sql sql is very important about 1.5 months you have to give in sql and if you don't know anything about sql try to give 4 hours 3 hours of a day in sql practicing the queries don't don't just learn about the sql i'll tell you what all the strategies you have to, you should do just don't learn about the things just, just, just don't read it out just don't see the videos try to practice it that is very very important and for for python majorly two months it takes don't think ki ha mere ko sara python pata hai bhaiya mere ko sara ko jada no you don't know anything try to be more problem solving aspects so sari cheeze seekho and that is very very important the problem solving aspects and the data domain uh, perspective is very very important the data engineering perspective of uh, things are very very important so those all things are there additionally 
Additionally, like understanding about the big data, big data understanding is required because if you are working on Spark, if you are working on Hadoop, if you are working on Hive, uh, on big data, so understanding is very, very important. So one month you have to give approximately on big data and I have listed uh, all the topics, all the things that you should study in big data. Don't uh, sit and study all everything about big data. No, don't do that. I have given everything. Don't, don't chill boy, chill, you can do it. Next thing is a data visualization tool. One month you have to give because in many companies what happens that that data visualization is firstly it is optional for a data engineer like if you have it it is a very good skill to have it and it will definitely help you and in many companies they will uh, write in the job description data visualization good to have tableau good to have power bi good to have okay so any of the tool you can start with and one month you can give and definitely that will help you and other than that these durations are considered when you are done you have done everything in parallel and three months approx are like it is not like that ki haan, like you will firstly read this then you will do this then you will do this then you will do this no when you are learning python you need to give some time for sql also you need to give some time for big data also slowly and gradually some some topics you pick and start learning about it next thing skills are very important so when you are starting with python about two months it will take to complete this and when you are these are the playlists that i have added and additionally i will add my bootcamp also you can go and join my bootcamp also definitely that will help you and then pandas for data cleaning is very very important that is pandas important pandas is just a library of python where we uh, like uh, serialized data processing is done and in serialized data processing we clean the systems like many times duplicate comes into a system many times uh, irrelevant data is there in the uh, data set so you need to clear off those things so that you can load that in a proper uh, way also that the data analyst and everyone can learn about it so that other thing so definitely those all things i have already listed here additionally like uh, sorry for that okay so here python for data engineering playlist is there so these all things you can just start and learn about it do practical stuffs and what are the practical stuffs you need to do i already have uh, badges on that you can just get these badges i'll challenge you can get these badges post on linkedin tag me definitely that will help you and it will give you a good reach other than that start with the top questions top questions of python like start from basics and these are the questions i have listed that ki, huh, if you do these problem solving questions definitely it will give you a good command on python so if you if, uh, go for python if else questions will be there then loops questions will be there these are all links these are a direct questions link if you tap on this it will redirect you to a link like uh, to a hacker rank this pay a question go and solve it okay next after solving these 8 9 10 questions you have uh, like completed the python clap firstly clap for yourself then start with sql sql is one of the like major tool uh, and people underestimate it because they think that ki, haan, sql select sari to hai no it is not like that bro it is not python is not print python is uh, much beyond that there are so much optimizations are there there are so many tools techniques are there you have to be good at it then only you will you will be getting a chance to get hired as a data engineer in a good company not just like a like random company a good company who, who are working on a proper data engineering projects on proper data projects on proper artificial intelligence projects gen ai projects definitely if you want to get into those things you have to be good at these skills then sql if you start with sql basics of sql is very very important i have already created a crash course on sql that is free other than that i already have a boot camp that i took on uh, it was a live boot camp you can just enroll in it early recordings are for lifetime you can just enroll in the boot camp definitely that will help you then query optimization uh, is very very important because in interviews it will be asked like 100 percent i take interviews of data domain i ask so many questions on query optimization these are a practical aspects of experiences that you should know so definitely that you should have so these are a direct link of youtube channels and youtube videos that you can go and uh, like uh, study from other than that there are questions that i have listed like uh, hacker uh, like hacker rank questions are there so similarly you can get a batch from here also of uh, sql as i have got a golden batch i have so similarly you should also have and uh, like uh, study those things link or uh, tag on my link uh, tag me on linkedin search me i will give all the links on my like in this particular sheet also and also in the description of all the videos i have given my linkedin okay so after completing these all things you have completed with sql and python those were the major things now there will be a debate ki ha you should go for a cloud or not so firstly i'll tell you that if you go for a cloud firstly you should be like good at python sql uh, pyspark you should know or pandas you should know so that these all concepts are only used in the like different different services of uh, cloud if you go for aws if you go for gcp if you go for azure microsoft azure any of the cloud you pick any one you can pick and you can start with if you know the fundamentals then only you start with 
with these uh, clouds otherwise you can just see like uh, because in cloud mostly it will be ui you will be like you will be clicking on different buttons you will be dragging dropping the things you will be writing the queries on there also but it is not a very different technology it is a new technology it is a new thing that should you should have but fundamentals are very very important be better at fundamental be good at fundamental then add these things because additionally agar main bolu to bhai there are so many tools are there there is airflow there is dbt there is uh, kafka there, there there are so many tools are there there is kuba there is five train everything is there etl tools are there there are different technologies are there so you should be good at fundamentals first then you should go for different different tools different technologies because all the technologies are a wrapper over these technologies only the fundamentals only they are using python they are using the big data they are using scala and but they have made a wrapper of python these all things are there so don't need to worry about those things don't jump on multiple technologies don't jump on multiple things then big data big data i have listed all the topics that you should know in big data so that you can understand about different different uh, cloud techniques that is understanding big data firstly what is big data then understanding hadoop what is hadoop everyone says that hadoop is there बिग डेटा के लिए हडूप चाहिए तो वॉट इज हडूप हडूप इको सिस्टम इज रिक्वायर्ड मैप रेड्यूस टेक्निक्स मैप रेड्यूस वर्किंग सिस्टम बिकॉज इफ यू लर्न अबाउट मैटर मैप रेड्यूस देन विल बी लाइक इफ यू नो अबाउट मैप रेड्यूस अपाचे स्पार्क विल यू वेरी इजी फॉर यू एंड यू विल बी गेटिंग एन एडवांटेज कि हाँ लाइक यू कैन डिफ्रेंशिएट बिटवीन दीज टू टेक्नोलॉजीज वॉट इज मैप रेड्यूस वॉट इज अपाचे स्पार्क यू कैन डिफ्रेंशिएट बिटवीन दीज टू टेक्नोलॉजीज तो दो दो थिंग्स कैन बी डन Apart from that, Hadoop versus Spark. What is the difference? Then Apache Spark architecture. You should uh, study Py Spark introduction. Major functions that are used in Py Spark. So you are clear of Py Spark. You are done these things. You have done. Then cloud uh, comes. Then I have listed AWS. You can learn any of the technology, any of the skills. Because I'll tell you my experience. I was skilled in GCP for three years. But when I got hired, I, it was not on any specific cloud. It was on a proper concept. What you have on uh, Py Spark understanding, on Python understanding, on SQL understanding. what you have and if you have additionally any cloud experience that will definitely be an added advantage and many companies do that but there are also many companies who hire for a specific role of a data engineer azure data engineer aws data engineer gcp data engineer those all things are also there so it depends on your things and additionally if you know one cloud you can jump on any cloud like after one month two months you can learn those things because similar kind of things are there there is also like uh, the, uh, in aws also there is a warehouse of redshift in gcp also there is a warehouse like uh, bigquery in azure also there is a warehouse synapse is there so definitely there are everything has uh, like different other things are there every technology has uh, same kind of services okay then projects and now you have learned everything you have uh, practiced the questions now the project section comes i have listed my projects also that i have made and also i have listed the projects that you you can make definitely this is a good playlist that you can follow and def- this will definitely help you it is all free definitely go and search for that other than that after completing all the project everything now comes the main part to apply for the jobs and now uh, like how to search for the jobs how to reach out to the recruiter how to get the jobs these all things definitely i have listed all the things here go to nokri i have uh, uh, like these are my videos only my experiences only uh, because i got about and my first which i got 200% of i definitely you can also follow those techniques how i uh, like because i got from my linkedin and, and from nokri also i got very good responses from the recruiters for the interview uh, roles and all definitely you can follow those steps help that, that that will help you and any personal guidance you can connect with me on my top mate on my linkedin on my uh, like instagram top mate will if you want a one to one connection ki yeah, personally you want to get some suggestions personally you want to connect with me uh, Uh, top mate is a better option you can just book the slots and we can talk other than that i have many boot camps that i have started and i'll be like posting uh, all the notifications all the stories on my instagram for the uh, like enrollments and all definitely you can follow me there also and these are all the free resources that i have listed to definitely ek like or comment to banta hi banta thank you so much for that for all the efforts it will be worth it if you do a like a comment definitely it will definitely help me to make such more videos and if you have any demand ki ha is type ki video banao just Just go in the comment section write it down i'll try to make a video as soon as possible thank you so much for watching other than that i have an instagram channel where i already like uh, already do like people are there i have been posting many content on data engineering on data aspects on data role on job market everything is there on ai we talk so many things about things things definitely go and uh, like uh, follow me there other than that uh, I, this channel is already there where i post so many videos on technical stuffs on job interviews on interview tips and all definitely follow it here also subscribe here other than that the, i have a uh, like vlog channel where i post many vlogs related to because i am settled in mangalore i keep sharing my experiences my life everything i if i go somewhere i keep share like make a vlog i post it there those all things as also you can follow thank you so much for watching this particular video thank you so much bye bye